Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is gonna be my Virgos. This is gonna be um, 8.15 to 8.31, 2019. I will tell you I'm excited to do you guys because my Virgos, that hermit's been popping in and I know it's linked to Virgo, okay? So, so what I love, let's give you a dragon card. Let's give you a dragon card. Ooh, I love you guys' energy right now. Virgos, Virgos. My Virgos, my Virgos. Okay. You got the Earth and Fire Dragon. Right, it works to clear fifth dimensional linings too. It's, it's telling you when you give, you receive. And it's linked to this yellow sunshine dragon. Um, you're good with animals, which is so ironic because it's not where this, it's like you guys just threw me way off. Um, reconnect with animals if you can. Okay. Um, help them, respect them, understand them. You're linked to them right now. Right now, pink, purple, and yellow are very strong colors for you. And I, I don't know why you have three of them, but you most certainly do. You're throwing me off, which means there's something that could be throwing you off, or you're purposely throwing someone off. But, like, I feel surprises. I don't know. Virgo, what's going on with my Virgos? Reconnect with animals, especially if you have them. Give them some attention. Okay? You got the seven of earth. But it's like give. If you give, you receive. And that movie just came to me. Feel the dreams. Okay? So maybe dreams coming true. But if you build them, they will come. You know, it, it's like tending to your dreams. You got the four of air. So healing from a situation. You obviously invested a lot of time into something. And now you're doing good. Okay? So I don't know if you neglected well, some of your animals get back in tune with them, or you, you're just, you're really good with animals. You've got the six of water right there. You healed from a past, whatever was happening in the past, and, and you still are, okay, and you got the ton of water, and you got a calling, okay, and I, I really think that's linked to, to animals for you guys, or just reaching out, helping, when you help, you receive, you know, when you give, you receive. It's like right back to the field of dreams. If you build it, they will come. So make sure you're willing to extend your hand. It will pay off big time. Lots of water energy, guys. Lots of water energy. I hope you are grounded. You're in your element with the seven of pens. Like you're in it. But like this is... Something about, tell me about the seven of earth. You're about to invest your time somewhere, all right? You're about to, to give an offer with the four of cups there too. Seven of earth, one more. You're either about to invest your time or someone's about to invest their time with you. It looks like to me you're about to invest your time with the emperor. So you're, you're going, you have this emperor energy. Go check out Aries too, okay? But you guys have are this empress energy coming in with these new starts too. So you're about to extend your hand. You're about to, some of you is, is in the household or it's linked to work. You're about to invest your time with something. And it's it's time. Okay. Um, four of, of air, please. I didn't call it, so I put them back up. Four of air. You're healing, you're rested, you're doing good. King of Cups. So we got this King of Cups energy looking on whether or not they're going to come back into the picture because it was reversed and invest time. So I don't know if you're dealing with a, a Pisces. Because you have two different gentlemen here. And one's linked to your past, a soulmate, a past situation, and somebody that made you happy or very unhappy. Um, someone's about to pour their heart and soul out into you or vice versa. Looks like you're into work and love. 
Tell me about the Six of Cups real quick. It's very emotional for you right now in the next couple weeks. You're going to be very emotional, but it's okay. I, I, I don't see it being a bad emotion. I see it being a good a good thing. Like you're going towards something or someone's coming towards you. It's all about helping if you give, you receive. So someone feels guilty for something that was unjustified that happened in the past with a soulmate. And I think it's linked to the King of Cups. But to me it's saying you've healed from that. If they come back in, I don't know if it's a, a lose-lose. I'm not really sure. But there's a new energy that's being presented that's at the forefront that's more important than whatever happened before that was no good. Tell me about the ton of water. So don't let this person's energy get the best of you because you got a new start. This could be some jealous. That's too many. This could be some jealousy from the past coming back in. Like, what do you mean you're working for X Y Z? Or what do you mean you're seeing other people? Or you know what I'm saying? Like, looks like you got a couple things to go through. And you got the world, and like I said, someone, someone's watching you, and someone's watching you have a new start, okay? So, your past is keeping an eye on you, and this new start is with an emperor, so I'd go watch Aries, okay? So it looks like my Virgos are in the Aries energy, or just strong Aries Virgo within your chart. You do have somebody from the past here, that did not go good at all. Yeah, tell me about the world real quick. <clears throat> if they come back, I think it's for jealousy reasons. I have the queen of, there was too many, but the one I saw was the queen reversed. All right, so whatever it is, it was a lot of weight. And listen to me, like I said, you've already healed from this. It looks like you got someone new, and my Aries had that combo too. Okay, so. Just be smart with your decisions. I don't do see decision making, but if somebody decides to stroll back in, my little Virgos, you have a new kickstart with something. Okay, it's it's time to give, so you receive. So it looks like you were giving, giving too much to a situation and not getting, and and now something with consistency and reciprocity is coming at you. Best advice, my Virgos. And you got the Ace of Fire, okay? So like I said, it's like you, you got yourself out of that Ring of Fire. And I just felt that strong. So some of you are in that Ring of Fire. I just did another Zodiac that was in that too. But regardless of that, okay, there's an exciting new opportunity that's coming your way. And it, it has to do with career advancement. And it's, it's about to change your life, all right? And there's that Queen of Earth energy. In the, and um, you also need to release something from the past. And it's linked to the Six of Water. So let go of somebody from the past. Um, somebody new is coming in, make room, make room, make time for those around you, okay, be thoughtful, be sensitive, be warm, be sensible, you know how to deal with challenges, um, and, you know, it's, it's, something's about to change your life, and an exciting new opportunity, and it, it looks like a career advancement, and this person would, would give that, right, but you're gonna have to invest your time. What I was going to say was, um, Oh, you guys must be having a massive headache, but it's not a headache. Your third eye is opening. Um, oh, either you're this emperor or the emperor is coming at you. And even if you're this emperor about to give a new opportunity, whoever you give this opportunity to as well is going to help build your career. So it's it's a win-win. It's beautiful. All right. So gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. If you guys are interested in the read, there's a link below in the description box. You can go ahead and click on it and order the read and I will email you back. If you're interested in an emergency reading, I can get it done to you within 24 to 48 hours, depending on my schedule. Okay. Alrighty then. I feel like someone's a cheerleader. Like, someone's coming in to cheer you up too. Alright, so once again, don't neglect your pets, pets or help the wild. If you see a little bird, bring it to a sanctuary. A sanctuary, all right? That there's a reason for it. You might connect really well with animals. You are earthly, right? But um, once you give, you receive. And remember, the colors yellow, pink, and purple are strong for you. I love you. Bye.